Hey ladies, so welcome back. So today's video is actually a collaboration with Little Pumpkin Pie 05 and Songbird Diva for Life. So we decided to give you a back to school collaboration and I attempted to give you guys this natural glam makeup look just in case you're looking for a husband while you're studying, which is what I did. So shoot, let me show you my tricks. <laughs> I'll be right back. <laughs> Don't move. <laughs> time for you to get straight A's. It's also time for you to snatch your husband, especially if you're going to be a senior in college. That's exactly what I did. I think the level did the same. Don't tell her I told you that. <clears throat> okay, but before you can snatch the husband, you better snatch your lids, okay? And the first way to do that is by making sure that you prep your lids by using some type of paint pot. Now, I'm going to be working with the Smorph palette. It's all these beautiful colors. And I'm going to take this cranberry color and apply that in my crease. Very easy. Just take a crease brush and just apply that real quickly. Then they had another lighter type of red cranberry-ish color that I applied in my outer V. I will have all the products and all the swatches on my blog. So don't fret. I'll make sure you get a husband. All right. <laughs> she got a husband. She got a husband. You need a husband. All right. So then you take this orange color later on and you apply that on your mobile lid, which is what I'm doing. This is a very easy look. It's a one, two, three, four eyeshadow look. Super easy because you got to also study, girl. Let's make it quick, okay? Then I take this really nice champagne color that's also on the palette. All the colors are from that Morph palette. And I apply in this outer part of my eye right there so that I can get a pop of color in my inner crease, I guess. And then go back and apply that red again on your outer V just to make sure that everything is well defined. Now, in case he happens, I mean, you never know. He could miss you, okay? So just to make sure that he really looks at you a second time, add some glitter on your lids so that way you'd be like extra cute, okay? <laughs> and then once you're done with that, you just want to go ahead and give yourself a really small, inconspicuous cut eye, but a really cute one. So that's what I'm doing with this uh, NYX eyeliner. I really like it. It's really affordable. I tried my best. Jackie said drugstore, so I really tried my best to make sure everything was drugstore. But don't worry. If he makes it and he graduates and he gets a good job, he'll get you everything you want. Then you can all graduate to the Tom Ford eyeliner pencil, girl. Yes, get your life. Okay? And before you apply any false eyelashes, if your lashes are really curly like mine are really curly, go ahead and tight line. And tight lining is just taking a black coal and just applying that at the extremities of your lash line to make sure that when you look up with your falsies that there is no gap all right and then once you're done go ahead and make sure that your skin is even baby nobody wants to fall in love with somebody that don't got good skin okay so if you don't got good skin just get some amazing foundation from the drugstore like black radiance okay and then you go ahead and you apply your concealer now for the day I would personally recommend a cream concealer like the one by NARS, which is what I'm using, because many of us are in school for about like five to eight hours a day, so just make sure you're covered at all times. And go ahead and apply some concealer in the corners of your lips and on your chin as well, okay? Good. See? You're starting to look real, real good. Shoot, you're going to get a husband. You get a husband, you better send me an invitation card. Shoot. Then I'm taking my um, Locket Tattoo Concealer by Kat Von D. So much to say at once. And I'm applying that just on the bridge of my nose. And I'm going to take my beauty blender and kind of diffuse the color so it's not such a harsh contour because this is daytime. I mean, it's such a harsh highlight because this is daytime. And I'm also going to take some of that concealer, the Kat Von D concealer, and apply it right under my eye in like the circle fashion. You don't, don't go below the nose. Don't make it dramatic. It's just right there under the eyes to give yourself this subtle radiance, okay? A little bit more radiance, honey. Yes. Okay. Yes. Healthy skin is everything, all right? And now, another trick I have for you ladies also to have really great skin during the year is to not apply your powder all over your face. Mm-mm. Mm-mm. Don't apply your powder all over your face. Apply your powder all around the face and leave the area under your eyes bare because we're saving that for something very special. 
And if you know me by now, you should know that it rhymes with glow, okay? So I'm going to take this Illuminator by NYX, and I am just going to apply that under the eye area. Now before, I used to have a really hard time with applying these products. Like, oh my gosh, it's messing up my foundation. But as you apply it and as it dries, it will settle really nicely with the concealer, okay? And you really apply these Illuminators like the same way you would apply concealer. Especially if they have this gold undertone. It would just go apply just like you would concealer, all right? And then once you're done applying it, take your beauty blender and buff that into your skin and make sure it sets really nicely. See, you don't always have to use powder under your eye area. No, you don't. <laughs> you seriously don't. And then for my lips, I'm using this nude color by Revlon. It's a very pretty nude. You'll be surprised the number of pretty nudes that you can get for deeper complexions. So if you're dark skin like I am, don't be afraid of nude lipstick. Nope. And to make sure that it's not too ashy, I'm applying another gloss by MAC all over my lips. I used to hate my lips. Now I love my lips. I sure do, girl. Can't tell me nothing. Uh-uh. <laughs> Alright, so ladies, yeah, make sure you love your lips. Make sure you love your nose. Make sure you love everything about you. Because, you know... He's also going to check out your GPA. I think she's what he did for me. So, it all going to work out in the end. Sure is. Then you go ahead and you apply your mascara. Also, drugstore by Rimmel. Go ahead, Marlene. And, yeah. So, that's it, ladies. That's the final look. Really radiant skin. I try to go really light on the brows because it's a daytime look. So, you don't need, like, super harsh eyebrows. It's too fake during the day. It's too much. I didn't contour at all with this look. I just highlighted my nose and under my eye area and just let the glow do its thingy. Ning nizzle. Feel me, son? That's it. All right, so here's Jackie. Here's the lapo. Click on the video. Go check them out. Tell them I sent you. I sent you late, but it's okay. Peace out. Bye.